And uh, well, look, after a brilliant game of rugby uh, and a really close vote, the fans have voted, and I'm delighted to announce that the winner of the triumph of the month for May is Ellis Finch. So, firstly, a huge congratulations, Ellis. How does it feel to be such a popular winner? Um, yeah, I don't score many, um, but this month I think I, I scored majority of our tries, so uh, I won by default. Um, there weren't many other people up for the up for the award, I don't think. Um, but yeah, any accolade you can uh, scalp in your career is always an uh, important one. So yeah, I'm, I'm over the moon. Brilliant. I'm, uh, I'm sure you're being overly humble there. But could you talk us through the try? Yeah, um, I scored two in that game. Uh, thanks for bringing it up. Um, so the first one was just a tap and go, five metres out. We had a penalty in... Um, I don't know why usually we go to the corner, but this week we spoke about doing something that we called a rhino, um, quite fitting, I guess, which is five metres out, me tapping the ball and, uh, yeah, just trying to score the try um, as opposed to going to the corner. And then the second one was a short line off of George Ford. Went through one, um, went about 10 metres, got brought down another ruck and I picked up again from two metres out and uh, got over the line. So not too glamorous, but uh, tries nonetheless. Yeah, no, indeed, indeed. And last Saturday's game against Bristol, again, a brilliant game, uh, even though the result didn't quite go our way, uh, against the top flight team, has to be said. Uh, how did it feel to be playing against the team from your hometown? And any thoughts on that game? Um, yeah, I've, I've played against them a few times now since they've been the Premiership. I was uh, only there whilst we were in the Championship. So it's, uh, it's almost as if it's a completely different team because when I was there, it's only three people left from my academy days at Bristol and the staff have changed completely, minus maybe one or two. So it doesn't really feel like I'm playing against um, sort of my old team, if you will. It's definitely my own city because um, I love the city uh, a lot. So um, it, it doesn't feel as weird as people would think. Um, a few of the boys asking me questions about it in the week, but... Um, Look, uh, I've only ever beaten once and a bit of a bitter defeat, obviously, with the circumstances, but we, we learn a lot from that. Brilliant. And the the atmosphere of the game, uh, amazing. How did it feel to be back in front of the crowds at the uh, Mattioli Woods Welford Road ground? Yeah, it was amazing. Um, were you at the game? No, I, no, unfortunately wasn't, no. Uh, okay, yeah, it was, it was electric for 6,000 people, which obviously only yeah. quarter capacity, but... Um, no, I thoroughly enjoy myself. Um, they're like our 16th man, a uh, bit of a cliche, but they yeah. are, uh, for me, the best fans in the league. And uh, and having been named in the uh, England 34-man training squad? I have, yeah. Um, yeah. I'm a bit of a senior player now. I've got the most caps in that one, so it's a different role for me. I'm not the uh, the young spunker that I was. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, how are you feeling about it? Are you feeling feeling confident, feeling, feeling old, proud? Mate. Yeah, I feel very old. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm proud um, over the moon to yeah. get selected. Um, quite a young team, um, a lot of new cappers, so it's a different challenge for for me in terms of how I can sort of bring these boys forward. Um, but no, I'm, I'm very excited to, to sort of develop um, a different sort of buzz in the camp, I guess, to what we've had for the past few years. Well, Ellis, thank you very much. Uh, uh, an amazing try, a brilliant game. Uh, congratulations once again from all of the teams here at uh, Tops. Thank you very much, Tom. Yeah, thank you very much for, I don't know if you can see it because of the, the green screen, but thank you very much for voting for me for Trial of Month. Uh, it means a lot and I'll enjoy this on a nice warm summer's night, not too far away, I hope. And a big thank you to all the supporters who voted um, and keep supporting us over the past week, a uh, few weeks. It's been a tough time for everyone, but um, yeah, I'd like to give this shirt to whoever won the award.